Good morning, John. What do we have here? We have the Mark 45 5-inch naval gun, which is the lightest, most compact weapon of its caliber. We have 160 of these systems in service with over 12 navies. We have three new technologies that we're presenting today. We have an automated handling system. We have the standard guided projectile and the hypervelocity projectile, which is going to extend the mission set of this weapon and the maximum range well out beyond 100 kilometers. This new technology that we're introducing to the Mark 45 will completely automate the ammunition storeroom. So we have a palletized system here which can accommodate standard length ballistic rounds or the hypervelocity projectile as well as extended length ammunition such as the standard guided projectile. All with the complete same design, it is very adaptable to different munitions as well as different size ships. For which platform is uh, this specific system intended? The first customer will be the uh, British Royal Navy on their Type 26. We are uh, in the final design phases transitioning to production, but this system is extremely adaptable to various size ships. Could it be possibly fitted on uh, French Navy frame frigates, for instance? Absolutely. In fact, we've integrated Mark 45 onto ships with displacements less than 3,000 tons. So FREM is, is more than enough ship to accommodate Mark 45 with the automated handling system. Have you discussed uh, or briefed uh, the French Navy about Mark 45 yet? We have talked to the French Navy. We've uh, been requested uh, to provide information uh, with details on the gun, the automated handling system, as well as the extended range precision guided munitions. And we have provided that to them as they make their decisions going forward for uh, the FRAM upgrade program. And uh, with the model here at uh, CR Space, can you point at the main uh, parts uh, of, the, of the system? Sure. So what we have here is we have two shuttles that move uh, from the storage locations to the existing lower hoist. So everything from this point up is completely the same as our users have worldwide. So there's very few modifications to their existing gun. This is a, just a, an addition to automate the magazine. The rounds are stored in pallets, so for survivability reasons, they are very well protected. But once they're in those storage locations, a sailor does not touch that ammunition ever again. And as far as the Type 26 is concerned, what are the main benefits of, of such a system? So, so much lower crewing, you don't have to have sailors dedicated to the gun and loading ammunition and moving it from storage locations to the weapon. That process has been completely automated and crew can now be allocated to other uh, functions. And then you have the safety issues as well, survivability of the ship, because the ammunition is much more protected uh, from potential threats. And what about... Uh maybe increased in the uh, firepower or rate of fire, should I say? Yeah, definitely. So you, you have a higher uh, rate of fire and you can sustain that rate of fire for a much longer period for the entire duration of the magazine. The magazine can then be rearmed quickly from other ammunition storerooms on the ship. All right, John, thank you very much. My pleasure.